everybody, welcome back to the Castos YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about importing a podcast from Anchor into a WordPress website and then up into the Castos podcast hosting service. You're going to need a WordPress website for the first half of this tutorial, and then you're going to need the seriously simple podcasting plugin, which I'll show you in a moment. So on your Anchor uh, podcast page, if you hover over the copy RSS link uh, and just click that, that will copy the RSS feed, which we'll then use to import into our WordPress website. So I already have seriously simple podcasting plugin installed. And when I go into the settings, we're going to go into import. You'll see down below, it says RSS feed. That's what we copied before. So now we'll paste it in. You'll see the anchor link uh, URL right there. And we'll click on begin import now. It's going to say, are you sure you want to do this? I'm going to say yes. If all goes well, you'll see a green success bar and it'll say everything was imported successfully. Now we'll go to all episodes. You'll see all of the episodes that I had on Anchor are now located in my WordPress website. If I click on it, you can see that the title is in there. Uh, the summary text of whatever I typed in in Anchor is there. And if we preview the post, uh, this is the, the player is in there. And when we hit play, it'll play the actual episode. Now, one thing to keep in mind, we'll scroll down below the, the post here, is that all we did is grab the URL of the media file on Anchor. And it means that this player, when you hit play on the front end, is still going to play it from the Anchor platform. So if you want to move or remove Anchor entirely and delete your entire library of content that's up there, then you'll have to be mindful to replace this file with the original podcast episode that you have. So you can either go back into your own local file, your local storage of all the podcasts that you've done and replace that. Or you can just say, you know what? I'm not going to delete Anchor, uh, my Anchor account. I'll let it stay there. And then for every new episode that you publish here in WordPress, the file will be here in WordPress. You won't have to worry about losing that file. It'll be right here on your WordPress website. So how do we solve that? If you want to completely just get away from Anchor and move on, uh, when you import up to Castos with a paid podcasting account over at Castos, Castos will actually download all those files locally to Castos, and then you can safely remove Anchor from your life if you want to get rid of it entirely. Let's go take a look at that process. Okay, so I have a uh, Castos account. I've already connected it to my Seriously Simple podcasting plugin here. We have other videos and documentation for that. I'll link it below. It's two seconds. You grab an API key and you connect your account with your email address. And now I'm going to say, import your podcast to Castos hosting account. We'll take a look at our account. We'll hit refresh just so you can see it. There's no podcasts up here right now. Back to WordPress. We'll trigger the import. Give this one moment. It'll say your podcast triggered successfully. Please check uh, your email for details. And in the background, <clears throat> behind the scenes, Castos is scooping up all of those files from Anchor and downloading them to your Castos account. It depends on how big your show is, how many episodes you have, the size of those episodes, etc., cetera, uh, which will determine how long it'll take. But you'll receive an email that says it's been finally uh, downloaded into Castos and you're ready to go. So let's just take a break, let this finish, and then we'll come back. Okay, so here we are in the Castos dashboard and the podcast has been imported. So we click into, <clears throat> I actually just noticed that I spelled the word podcast wrong. <laughs> I'll show you how to change that in a second. Um, so my new podcast, the one that I imported, it's all of the episodes from the Anchor podcast. And if we go into my WordPress website, you can just see how the show titles correspond there. So terrifying tales of tech short reads, kind of a more serious one. Um, and here's those episodes that I just read off. So they've synced everything up. It's in Castos now, and I'm ready to go. It, these files are now safely stored in Castos. Whenever anyone's downloading this new podcast uh, from the Castos feed, they'll be getting it directly from here. And it's safe to say you can remove anchor from your life uh, at this point. You can 
continue to publish episodes through WordPress. Every time you want to upload a new episode, you would come in and click on add new podcast, fill out the show title, fill out the description, and then upload the video right here. I mean, the uh, episode right here in the select podcast file section. Or if you want to completely remove WordPress uh, later on down the road, you can always come into your Castos dashboard, go to my account, click on podcast settings, and then safely remove uh, the connection to WordPress. And you can say, I'll publish my content right here from Castos dashboard. And that would help you uh, just come to Castos to upload your files here, upload your media, put your show description, your show notes, et cetera, right through the Castos da dashboard. That's the kind of flexibility uh, that we hope we offer you. Having a great integration with WordPress, having a great podcast hosting account. Uh, and that's how you move away from Anchor. If you have any questions, drop us a question below in the comments. Shoot us an email. Hello at castos.com. We'll be happy to answer your questions. Thanks a lot, everybody. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up if you liked the video. Subscribe if you want more podcasting stuff. We'll see you in the next video.